Well, hey everybody, Scott Kelby here from KelbyOne.com. Got a quick tutorial for you on Lightroom Mobile's uh, graduated filter. So it's the one from desktop, now it's over in the mobile version. I wanna show you how it works. So if you tap over here on the left side of the screen, you see you've got all these different choices, right? But if you look at the bottom, there's a new icon across the bottom, number five. It's the local adjustment, and you have your choice of two, either linear, or radial we're going to go with the linear selection and then all you're going to do to darken the image to darken the sky and have it go gradually to transparent is you're going to tap at the top of the screen and drag down as you can see it's darker at the top and then as far as you drag down I usually drag kind of to like the horizon line and the reddish tint that you see up top that's the area that's affected so now you would just go well this is what I would do tap on exposure and then drag the exposure to the left to darken that sky and you also might want to pull back the highlights a little to bring some detail back in there and again if you want to you can just kind of change how far down it comes down by tapping right on the center if you want to rotate you can just tap right on the white lines all right, you can add any other features you want here. For example, if you wanted to add the, let's see, where is it? Right down here, the color hue. So if you wanted to add a particular shade of blue to the sky, you could do that as well. And then if you don't want it at all, you can just hit the little garbage can icon up there on the top left and give it a try again. So that is the new uh, graduated filter tool that they added to Lightroom Mobile. Hey, if you like this kind of stuff, and I know that you do because you're watching a Lightroom tutorial, go to, uh, go to kelby1.com, take the 10-day free trial, and uh, check out our ton and ton and ton of Lightroom stuff. We have Lightroom stuff on any topic that you could want to learn. So I hope you'll check it out. I'm Scott Kelby. We'll catch you guys next time.